What you doing here this early? Just now walking into the suite, man. Good morning. And it is a good day because I got a new package in. First, what I like to do is I'll put my apron on, guys, in the morning. Since I've already sprayed down my chair and everything in the room and cleaned it up the night before, I'm good on that. But I like to make me a cup of coffee. I don't know if y'all drink coffee, but I drink only the best. Cafe Busteo. Get you up and going. Let's go ahead and make this coffee. Um, nice gold and black cups with lids and straws. I, I just love the Cafe Busteo. Um, put this in Kire. I had one yesterday. Pop that down. But what's funny is I don't like drinking hot coffee, so I'm glad that I have a mini fridge after I'm done making my coffee. I'll put it in the fridge, get to my first client. After the first client, my coffee's good to go. I don't know if y'all are familiar with this logo, Slicker. I actually reached out to this page. I wanted some information on this product. They sent me this product. I'm going to be rocking this. So today and tomorrow, and then next week, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, because I only went down to a three day schedule. I am going to give my full 100% feedback on this product. Nonetheless, let's go ahead and unbox it and put this on. That way I can be ready for my first client. All right, so I have here the box. I'm gonna go ahead and open it with a blade, a sharp blade. I'll throw it in there. Dope packaging. There's some uh, pamphlets in here. This looks like, just like a business card. So this is called the rig. And that's their um, product and also their Instagram name at the top. This is basically like the breakdown of the product, um, the different slots that it has. Quick release metal buckles, tapered shear pockets for your scissors, comb storage, elastic loops for clipper and trimmer storage, instructions and care. Flip the rig upside down and shake to get the hair out, I'm assuming. Blow out pockets with hair dryer. Um, spray vegan leather friendly disinfectant on a soft towel and white. So that's like real leather. So this is the bag. Dope, dope packaging. This is their logo on it. The tongues are like scissors. So these are my go-to's right now. My go-to combination is the Rose Gold Skeleton FX trimmers and also my Gamma Ergo clippers. So I believe I'm gonna have this one like that. And I'm gonna have my trimmer right here. He did tell me that it fits guards. Your half guard, your one guard, one and a half guard and two guard. I'll go ahead and do my half guard, okay? So I have my half, my one, my one and a half, and my two guard. And these are just some extra clips. That's a pretty dope setup. Now, what the um, CEO did tell me was, it's gonna be a little while till you get used to having all your stuff on you versus reaching to your station. I wanna make sure that I give it a good run through before I get my honest feedback on it. Again, going through it. I have my Gamma Ergos, my Babilis FX Skeleton Trimmers, my Duck Clips, my YS Comb, my two Tomb 45 shears and thinning shears, my half guard, one guard, one and a half, and two guard. My coffee should be ready. Let's see. It's a little warm, but it'll do. Mm-hmm. Put my mask on, gonna go get my client. All right, so we're gonna utilize this product. On the first client. Which we've already been talking about. So, oh, look, see, I went over there. Yeah, I just, so, look, I just went back over to my station just cause of muscle memory. Man. All right, so I took out the power clip. Hopefully that gets in my head that I don't need to put it down a charge. I'm so used to putting it on the mat. 
So, yes, I went right for it, bro. I didn't even know. The only thing that I would probably ask about this product is longevity. If I rock this for four or five years, it's gonna get beat up. What is it gonna do to my back, my pop? It, mm -hmm. it may, maybe, may make me stay straight versus Take always punching over. Yeah. Um, but the weight distribution is obviously in the front, so. Yeah. You know what I mean? On a Sunday? Yeah, because of one of the shows that we watch. Damn. So that's like a mm, automatic. We got to get that up. For sure. <laughs> <laughs> All right, y'all. So I just finished my second client. But just to give you an update on this uh, chest harness. It's pretty dope. Obviously, in the first, whenever I was cutting the first client with it, I kept going back to my station. But it was just, it's just muscle memory. I've been cutting like that for so long. Um, but now I'm starting to get the hang of it that everything is right here. And honestly, I don't feel anything on my back as of right now. I don't feel no, no tension or pressure on my back. I am more than likely sure that this is gonna help me do that five minute challenge in five minutes. No doubt about that. If I can just remember everything is right here, I feel like I can knock out a haircut in five minutes on a challenge only. I'm not trying to do that while I'm cutting my clients throughout the day, but so far so good. But again, they're so ergonomically built that it's not too heavy. I think with your old clippers, you can't rock like an Oscar 76 on there or even I would even say like the, the senior the reflections those are pretty heavy clippers so what would I work with on a day-to-day -day basis for, for right now second cut in I feel good it's a power. Y'all done seen me use the rig by Slicker Technical Barber Tools. I've used this already for a whole week. I love the product, man. And right now what I was doing is I already removed all my tools. And as shown on the pamphlet that it comes in the box, just take your blow dryer, blow all the hair out. Because this is real leather. So you don't want to add too much products on it, do too much to it. You don't want to mess with the leather too much i really didn't feel a lot of weight distribution on my chest throughout the time of me using it whenever you put your guards in because you know it's on your chest and you're looking down to grab a guard out 
What I would recommend is put the teeth, right? This way, down in the pocket, okay? That way the clip that goes on the clipper is pointing out away from you. If I have it this way, some reason, I mean, these pockets, they have to get adjusted to your guards. They're gonna have to kind of open up and basically be used for a couple of times. That way they can slide out smoothly. But this, doing this way with the clipper facing inwards towards you, it, it kind of gets snagged sometimes in the inside of the pocket. So what I've learned is if you have it facing this way with this clip that goes onto the clipper, right? Facing outwards, you're able to even grab that and pull your guard out. Everything that I use for a haircut um, is all on my chest, other than using a water bottle to spray the hair down before doing a scissor cut, maybe some um, products or even aftershave, but everything is, is on me right here. I love the product. Thank you, Slicker, for sending this out to me. Tyler, bro, I appreciate the conversation that we had. Again, guys, this is not a sponsored video. Um, I'm not partnering with them in any type of way. This is just strictly a relationship that was built through social media. And I got this product in my hands, and that's why I'm doing a review. Guys, I would say give it a try. Invest in it. If you want to speed up your haircuts, I guarantee you this will do it right here. I'm going to revisit the five minute challenge with this product, so stay tuned for that. But guys, this is an investment. Like I said, guys, the straps are dope. The buckles are metal. It has different lengths to it too. You can make it tighter or, or looser. I really have no cons to say about this product, guys, honestly. Um, I'm not being biased. Again, this is not a sponsored video. I don't earn nothing from it if y'all purchase this item. Definitely check out the link in the description below. Check out the company. Check them out on Instagram as well. Check out their pictures and, and other barbers that are using it, how they use it, what type of tools they use in their rig. Check them out. They're dope. Tyler, man, I appreciate you. Thanks for the opportunity for sending out this, this product and showing my subscribers a new innovation. That's dope, man. If y'all are not yet subscribed, make sure you hit that subscribe button, like, share, comment. We are at 100K, man. Thank you, thank you, thank you for all the love, all the support since day one. Man, the journey has been amazing. Guys, we hit 100,000. Let's go, man. Hey, Team Gifted, stay gifted.